So I just tried calling the kid's law guardian. And he says, uh, oh, the phone's breaking up. I can't hear anything you're saying. So I go outside and try to uh, make it clearer. I keep asking him, can you hear me now? I just ended up hanging up. None of these people are going to help us. I told them my phone don't work. And he tells the judge I'm denying him access to the kids because I didn't get the phone calls. He can't even hear me on the phone, but that's the precedent that's set in court now because once what whatever these people say, it's not what I say. The deck is stacked against me because of everything John Banks has ever said about me. Todd Quick's pissed because John Banks didn't want to be his boyfriend however many years ago. So instead, John introduced him to his gay brother, Eric. <sighs> Todd is not straight. He's gay. And he used me and these kids to cover it up. So at this point, I believe because the law guardian said to the kids, he kept saying to him, call me, call me. Like there's something going on here. Like I'm abusing them or not letting anybody talk to him. I don't, I don't know why this keeps being put out there that way. I don't understand. So the law guardian said to the kids that if they want to go to the same foster home or different foster homes, because apparently it's a possibility they hate each other too. I don't know what they're trying to insinuate. So it's obvious to me, this is why Todd Quick said, why do I need a lawyer? I think, I think it's just over. They don't, fathers don't have to have any responsibility of their children. And it doesn't matter how much I care about these kids. No one else has to. Everyone just has a job to do. That's what they're going to do. And in this area, it's the mom that's the problem. Especially if she's poor. So that's that, I guess. I don't know how this law guardian is supposed to talk to the kids. With our shitty phones, then, we can't even call and talk to him. And he's not my lawyer anyway. He's the kid's lawyer, so I probably shouldn't even have tried to call and talk to him. He's going to soak up all the information he can from the men in the situation because dicks stick together. It's just what they do. It's just what they do.